What's your thoughts on that brilliant 2 1 win against Bryant at Sea Regent? Yeah, it's a, it's a real workman like performance that they're. Um, they're, they're very, very good. Their rotations are exceptional, the way they keep the ball and move it around. We were just very, very effective in our attacking play today and our counter-attacking was, was second to none. And uh, the, the grit, the determination, the character was unbelievable. So extremely pleased with them. The whole, the whole 15 boys that are here tonight, it's an outstanding shift from them. I think every player put their body on the line tonight as well and that was just amazing yeah, when, to watch. When you think in the last five, ten minutes, you've got Callum Thompson, who's played probably 100 minutes in three years. He's diving back in to make last ditch tackles and then Dev in the last one in the middle there. It shows that, that we've got a bit about us this year. We've got a bit about us and we're, we're ready to compete and um, extremely pleased, extremely pleased tonight. Because tonight for me was our biggest test, not just footballing wise, but men mentality wise this season as well. Travelling travelling on a Tuesday night after work through traffic and so on, it can uh, it can take its toll and it can set the tone and, and credit to the boys in there tonight, they were exceptional. Kai Brown again scored another brilliant goal. Yeah, it's, it's getting boring now, isn't it? Really yeah. talking about. I just said to me there, you know, it's, it's getting boring now. But he, he, he was what we was missing last season, in my opinion. He was missing that that real, <clears throat> that real clinical instinct, and, and he's in an unnatural position. But but now it's becoming more and more natural for him week in week out, and and he's been he's been superb for us, and and the, he's led the group exceptionally well in terms of our attacking play and, and they know they can rely on him to deliver and he, he's delivered week in, week out. Good to see Ben Allen playing tonight as well and get on the score yeah, shoot goal, as well. Goal and an assist for Ben. He, he's, he's been really patient. Um, he's not had it his way really this season and it's, it's horrible as a manager to see to see players get their heads down and, and stuff like that. But he's was, um, he was brilliant tonight. I thought he was exceptionally good and uh, he, he fully warrants his goal and an assist. Uh, Blossy, he just seems to be getting better every game, and um... I mean, we could go through the whole team. Yeah. They it was all yeah, all exceptional tonight. Uh, I think Jamie Bennett's made a huge difference since coming back in the side. Thought he was he was brilliant again tonight, and just as a group, as a collective, at the moment it doesn't seem to matter what eleven we put out on the pitch. Um, you got to think the likes of Georgia Coy and Clyde Samazi. George was superb Saturday. He's missed out tonight, and Clyde's been in, in, in really good form, and he's missed out as well. Uh, as well as Marty Gage, the, the four boys on the bench were, were, were probably be disappointed because they probably felt they should start, and, and, and in a way they, they all do have that right. And at the moment we've got a group of players that, that are all fighting for the same cause, and, uh, and it's a pleasure to manage at times. Fifth in the table as well. Yeah, it's far too early to be looking at the table, Andrew, far too early. Um, but we, we just we, we had a tough start fixture wise. So to be sitting sitting in the in the playoffs in in mid October is, is is not what I expected, if I'm honest with you. Uh, in fact probably the opposite of what I expected. But we just need to keep working hard on to the next one Thursday and then Enfield at home on Saturday. Uh, it's just next one to tick off the box. Okay. Cheers Darren. Top man, Andrew.